Innocent people are out millions of dollars after reports of mail theft and stolen checks are surging. I-Team investigator Jackie Calloway found thousands of these checks for sale on the dark web. The number of attacks, assaults, and robberies on Alber mail carriers tripled between 2018 and 2021. He had almost like a ski mask on. All I could see was his eyes. And the U.S. Postal Inspection Service counted nearly 300,000 mail theft reports between 2020 and 2021. Tampa police detectives say the bad guys are after checks in the mail and keys that unlock cluster boxes like those at apartment complexes. Have you ever had as many reports of stolen and cash checks as you're receiving lately? No, I have not. In some cases, the bad guys alter and cash the checks. My bank sent me a message saying that I may have insufficient funds in my account. Often wiping out bank accounts. Jane Anthon mailed a $68 check to pay her water bill. Then it was stolen. I saw this check for $14,000 that I had not written. But modern day crooks often choose to sell stolen checks instead of cashing them. It's not a group of adolescents stealing your mail. We're talking about organized crime groups. Georgia State University professor David Maiman researches cybersecurity crime. The price for, an, uh, for personal checks is usually between $120 to $150. For the past two years, Maiman and his team have monitored dozens of dark web channels that sell stolen checks and keys to the big blue mailboxes. The increase in, in the volume of stolen checks is dramatic. In 2021, Maiman's group found an average of 1,000 stolen checks for sale on the dark web. But this year, that number more than tripled. Florida is definitely one of those hubs where we find many, 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 many checks. Yeah. There is a postal police force, but they only protect postal property and they're not allowed to guard carriers on their routes. But the Government Accountability Office is about to launch an audit that could prompt a change in the use of postal police officers. I'm I-Team Investigator Jackie Calloway taking action for you.